hello there and welcome back to another video if you're new to this channel welcome my name is chris and sadly i have to interrupt my travel vlog adventures just for a little bit to insert this video here something special is happening today and i want to take you guys along with me so roll it that happened beforehand happy maple leaf stay home opener this is my first maple leaf game on this channel for the 2023 2024 season something i forgot to show you guys so on home opener days they give away like this scarf and they put it in all the seats it's so cute i absolutely love it happy home opener to those who celebrate this has to be on winning in october getting out to a good start and staying present in the moment Number two, pushing 300. Austin Matthews is coming off of the season where he put up 40 goals and 85 points. In fact, over the last four seasons, he put up 40 goals or more. And this is the guy who is motivated coming into this campaign. Of course, he's one of the best five on five goal scorers in the NHL. Brad Schilling has said this guy is wired for greatness. It is all that he thinks about. And if Austin Matthews scores even one goal tonight, he will hit 300 in his NHL career. NHL debut at
still will ring today and tomorrow and ever onwards on every brink, street, and gym floor. With every kid who picks up a stick and dreams of making a game there. Who stay united in belief that Toronto will be the site of fresh miracles to come. That we're only getting started. All of us. Together.
comment and said Jake Evans from the Montreal Canadiens looks like Max Verstappen, and I think he just scored. Sorry, guys. Do 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 do. Max Verstappen. <laughs> have a new goal horn. It'd be great if they could score because I want to hear it. Marner, Tavares, Marner, Matthews, Klingberg, Newlander. It's 20 minutes of no scoring is making me hungry. Also, it's dinner time. It's like past 7 p.m. I usually eat at 7 p.m. So time to look around and show you guys what are things to eat here. Burgers. You have the food junction, which is over there. And what I'm pointing at is where you can get your hot dogs, your chicken nuggets, your spicy chicken nuggets, actually, and nachos. Here is my favorite spot. So you can get pizza over here and my infamous poutine over here. So some pizza flavors you can get from here are the meat supreme slice chicken pesto slice and the bruschetta slice and then the different types of poutine you get here are two of my favorites which is the rotisserie chicken poutine and the turkey dinner poutine I told myself I was gonna try something different every game that I'll go to it's always the same I always run to the rotisserie chicken poutine it's a green slice one rotisserie chicken poutine and just the regular like pot. Oh uh, yes, cook with no ice. The crowd and we got our food. So we're having advice. Leave about like three minutes before the game, the period ends, and manifest that nothing good happens while you're gone. So thankfully, when I left, nothing good happened. I didn't really miss much. Just that I got my food. <laughs> This period, the puck was always on this side. This period, we score this way. So the puck should stay on this side. You feel?
18, Noah Gregor at eight minutes. Maple Leafs goal is first of the season. Seven minutes. And first as a Maple Leaf. It's the ATM line for ya. Not because they're called Austin, Tyler, and Mitch. This sounds creepy, but there's a show called The Bachelor, and there's Zach and Katie. For himself, Austin Matthews at 15:51. That's Austin on the power play for 300 NHL career goals at 15 minutes and 51 seconds. I'm pretty sure I counted it right this time. Scored by number 34, Austin Matthews. Assisted by number 16, Mitch Marner. And number 91, John Tavares. Top of the goal, 14.51. Matthew. Hey, you know what? I, I was off by a minute. It's fine. It's okay. I shouldn't count backwards. I told y'all, the ice is lopsided. They kept scoring, like, on this side. So now that we score this way, they're scoring this way. So the ice is lopsided. from doing other things apart from filming this end of video outro so funny story was that my phone died when I was filming Austin's hat trick but a shout out to my dad for taking a video of the end of game celebratory win shout out to the Leafs for pulling through shout out to Mitch Marner for scoring the shootout winning goal so parts that we've missed after Austin's tying goal 
was the three on three overtime, but thankfully nothing happened, which is why it led to the shootouts. And wow. So let me just start over from the beginning and just talk about it. So firstly, firstly, they gave out scarves today, which is really cool. I'm more used to rally towels, but the scarf feels really nice. So it's nice to bring something home that's not a rally towel. And it's a fashion statement. Fashion statement or a you've had to be there type thing. Again, sorry if I'm doing this. I am removing my makeup while I'm doing this outro. And this serves as like my mirror, so please don't judge. Secondly, there are some new acquisitions on the Leafs. So for example, we have Tyler Bertuzzi, Max Domi, Fraser Minton, Matthew Nice, Reeves, and I feel like I'm missing a couple. Oh, right, of course. Congratulations, Joey, Joe, Joseph Wall. You are now the backup brick wall to Samsonov. You've made the official re you've made the official Leafs roster and I can't wait to see you do what you do best, be a goalie. So I can't wait to see you play full time and good luck this season. Okay, so, oops. so game time, huh? We were trailing, so I feel bad. I feel like <laughs> every time I talked about a Habs player, that Habs player did something. For example, earlier when I said like, hey guys, look, Jake Evans from the Habs looks like Max for stopping. He scored and the song do 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 Max for stopping like came in my head and I'm like, great. And when I was saying that the I feel like the rink is lopsided because Everybody who was like scoring facing towards me, it's so, like going this way, kept scoring. So like the Habs in the first period kept scoring. We tied and then led. And then after that, we swapped sides, <laughs> was trailing by two, which leads to a shout out to Austin Matthews for his, okay, this is like a number three that you'll be hearing for his third goal of the game, which is called a hat trick, when my phone died. Sad times, y'all, sad times. 300 of his career, but then he scored three, so three, zero, three, see a bunch of threes in there. Goals of his NHL career. And yeah, so after he tied it, it went to overtime and then thankfully nothing happened in overtime and then it went to shootouts which was really fun because the three on three that they had so it was mitch austin and willie or willie mitch willie austin mitch if we're going in that order so willie went first didn't go through nick suzuki of the habs didn't go through and little thing about nick suzuki that is that there's this person who works at my family pizza shop who looks like Nick Suzuki. So every time I saw Nick Suzuki, I jokingly kept saying, come on, Nick, why are you here? Don't you have some pizzas to make? So yeah, this is a little quirk for my family if they, get, if they make it this far. So Pizzeria Familia, one of your workers who looks like Nick Suzuki, Google him, Nick Suzuki, N-I-C-K-S-U-Z-U-K-I, Nick Suzuki. You'll see who he looks like. Wink, wink, you'll get it. Uh, yeah, so Nick Suzuki didn't score. And then Austin Matthews, everybody was cheering for him, for him to hit it with the four, like Austin Matthews, but he he didn't do his usual backhand, so it didn't go through. And then Cole Caulfield, Cauliflower Caulfield, didn't make it either. And then Michelli Marner did the score to goal. And then I can't remember the name of the third Habs guy, but he didn't make it. So yay, Mitch Marner is the shootout winner. So the next game that the Leafs play is on Saturday. I can't remember who they're playing against, but it should be a fun one. And thank you for keeping me company while I removed all my makeup. It's clean now. So 
Thanks for coming along with me with today. Thank you for letting me interrupt my little vlog series to post this one because why not? And yeah, I'll see you in my next video and have a good night. And before I forget, make sure to like, comment and subscribe. Oh, and I also have like a community thing on YouTube where I just discovered it like recently. So I'm gonna be posting like random stuff there. And yeah, oh, before I go. I met people from The Bachelor. So Zach and Katie, if for some reason you guys see this video, hi guys, you guys were so amazing to talk to. Love you guys. And I hope to see you guys again soon. Okay, that's it. Bye.